Welcome back, folks. So, we lost, unfortunately. Uh, because it didn't tell us that we won our contracts. But we're, we're, we're going to start over. We're going to get up to 40. Uh, oh, no. We just want 25, don't we? 25. 15 is 40. No, 35 plus 15. So we have 40 of those now. Um, let's do some research. We're going to go through this starter phase a little bit quick. Uh, what I do want to do is go into the administration, staff, and the research center. Let's see. All turret, primary weapon, secondary weapon. I do want him, but I want this guy first, I think. Uh, power unit and running gear adept. So we're going to hire him. Uh, yes. Um, uh, what is yours, assembly expert? So we want you in once we start building stuff. So we will add you to the research center. Uh, we'll go into the research center and I want to take a look at the building overview. Uh, maintenance a thousand. Uh, hmm. So I, I don't know if this is worth doing. I really don't. So maintenance is minus 2,000, but it only costs 1,000 in maintenance now. What if we did... Hold focus. Does this... Does that increase maintenance? You know what? Let's try it. Yes. We will see and see if the maintenance goes up. Um, did we assign any research yet? No. So I want to get the Mark 5. We'll do these two. No, wait. We started out with the guy who does mobility stuff. So we'll start out with these two, I guess. Two days. We don't really have anything else for them to do, so we'll just do that. Uh, in here, I kind of want to get this uh, sub-assembly focus. So we'll upgrade that. Uh, engineering. Uh, Building overview. Hmm. Uh, no, no. Let's just uh, stick with this and go. Okay. Enhanced power output. We'll go with the exhaust management. We'll just power th through this a little bit quick. All right, exhaust management. Uh, and I want the inline engine. I want the Ricardo six cylinder. So we'll do that. And we'll get that going. All right, William Foster Company. Okay. Uh, let's quickly jump out here and see. There aren't any contracts, are there? No, not right now. There are no... no there's nothing. Alright, good. Going inline engine is done. Then I want to upgrade the running gear. Uh, let's take this down. 
three days. And let's take a look at engineering. Uh, so power unit, the Ricardo. We want the handbrake, because I think that's the better option. It's also lighter. Uh, we will have the tubular radar, radiator for sure. It's reliability or repairability goes down a bit, but the obstacle slope, range, and reliability goes up. So we'll add that. Uh, minus one transportability, no. Uh, we'll go with the wick carburetor because that seems like a good thing. We'll go with the twin spark plugs. And we'll go with the exhaust manifold. Six days. You know what? Let's hire 10 more engineers. Let's hire them. And we'll quickly get this power unit going. That one. That one. No. The wick carburetor. The twin spark plugs. And no. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay. So three days, start, yes, go. All right. Okay, resource uh, prices decreased. So that is great. And we have some rivals hiring. So we want to get some materials, some high carbon steel. Uh, I think we'll get all of this from the Ottoman Empire. And then some medium carbon steel, I think. We can get all of that as well. So that takes us to the max. That's fine. One, all right. So the Ricardo six cylinder engine is done. The low track running gear is done. Let's get the improved track pins in three days. Yes. Okay, we can get a running gear going. Centipede. We'll go with those. We'll go with the tempered steel ones, because they are really good. And we'll go with these guys. So minus one agility, but plus one road speed, plus one cost country speed, and plus two reliability. Three days. Yes. Okay. Okay. So that's the centipede running gear done. Oh, can we make some improvements to that? I think I want to put this guy on. And then the dying court uh, ball mounts things. And that's it. But this is what we're going to do. Oh, this is engineering. Let's wait a second because we want to max our research. Um... Power unit. We want the side valve engine. We want the improved power transmission. That's the first thing that we want. Uh, let's see. 
25 on that, I guess. And then we can go to engineering to the other guy. This guy... Plus one awareness. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. We'll do that. We'll do the... Dying court thing. And that's it. Three days. Alright. I'm not renaming the parts. Okay, whole workshop one. Hey. And the sub assembly line one. Good. How much does it cost to upgrade to sub assembly line two? 20,000. You know what? I'm going to do it. Take 21 days. We're not designing anything yet. All right. Improved power transmission. The landship committee favors tanks. Okay. So we have 25 engineers available. We need more. Let's get in more. So we have 40 available. And I think we're going to switch to structure. So what I want to do is staff. We want you. All turret, primary and secondary weapons. So we'll employ you. We will remove you from there. We will add you. And then Let's see fire accident sabotage. So what if we put you in the engineering department? Just for now. Okay. All right, we got some materials. Outstanding. The Mark One hull is done. And let's do some research here. Did I forget to do research before? I don't think so. We have one primary weapon. We have a power unit. We have a running gear. Uh, let's take a look at the primary weapon. The shoulder rest, plus two to accuracy and aiming, minus one to liability. That's okay. Let's just do that. It'll take a day. Done. Six pounder gun done. Okay, so I guess we can design a tank now. We'll put you on there. We'll put this centipede running gear on there. We'll put the Ricardo six cylinder on there. The Lewis MG, the Mail Mark One turret, and the upgraded quarter pounder or six pounder. Sorry, not a burger. Uh, commander, uh, driver, gunner, gunner, loader, mechanic, uh, mechanic loader, and that's all we need. We don't need another crewman, so we'll try not having one. We'll give you that. We'll give you the bandolier. And... I guess a revolver as well. Ammo, we'll do... 
common shell and that shell. We are under the weight limit, so that's good. We'll again call it centipede one, mark one. That'll take nine days to design. Let's do it. Okay. Reinforced hull. We will do the chaser hull as well. Go, go. That's the chaser hull done. Then we'll go with this. That'll take five days. Do it. Because I want the skins ball mount and I also want them at five. So let's jump, jump out here and see if there are any uh, contracts. Nope. Not yet. Okay. Tank core is formed. Okay. Okay. So let's go see what that means. So no contracts. No regiments or anything. Okay. All right, the extended hull is done. Then we'll switch to turrets. Okay, start. Yes, days, three days, two days. Okay, centipede mark one is done. Let's, let's put it through some trials. And that means that we can now go in here and we can make a Mark 5 plus 3 transportability, plus 1 reliability, plus 1 repairability. Definitely. The unditching beam for sure. Plus 4 crew awareness. It's heavy though. Now we want the skins ball mounts. Uh, those are heavy, no. I think we'll leave it at this. That'll take four days. Do it. A riveted sloped sponson. Uh, the superstructure we need. We might be able to get it down to four days if we hire two more. But let's just do it. Yeah, four days. All right. So four days, three days, two days. Files complete. Let's have a look. So 53 firepower hard, 90 crew performance, 59 firepower soft, 54 reliability, 84 protection, 158 mobility, and 121 durability. Okay. Uh, any new contracts? It really worries me with the contracts because it's not telling me if it's something comes. Engineering project mark five. Okay. Um, let's do some secondary upgrades. I like that one. Well, the rate of fire, actually, no. Okay, so there is no point in doing that just now. Uh, I suppose we could design a whippet running gear, but 
seems stupid to be honest. Right, riveted superstructure. Uh, let's do the tempered steel things, or... You know what, let's do explosive munitions. Take two days. We can now... Do one of these. I think this is worthwhile. I wouldn't mind that, but it's heavy. We'll just do this. One day. Do it. Alright, rear cab. So that should mean that we can now design this. Twenty-eight thousand two hundred and three kilos. Uh, we need a commander. Driver. Gunner. A gunner. Gunner. A loader. A commander. A mechanic. And a mechanic loader. That's where we wait. We haven't put the gear in yet. Uh, we'll get those. Get that. Guess we'll go with those but see we're way 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 overweight and I don't have a means of reducing that weight not enough anyway I just don't have a way of getting it to a reasonable weight It's insane. It just goes over. Right. Right. I have explosive munitions. So what we need to do is reduce weight. So there's these light engine components, but will that actually reduce the weight of the engine? I don't know. I don't know. No contracts. Yet. Okay. Heavy infantry support. So it's 28,000. Firepower soft, mobility, and protection. We have a concept now. But we don't have contract. Okay. Well, I'm gonna wait the one day. So now we have the production assembly line two. It's like 56 days. That's too much. That is way too much. 
What date is it? The 6th of May. I am going to hire all 50 of these. Twenty-five days to produce fourteen. That seems reasonable. Start on that. And we need more high carbon steel. There's a little bit available there. And then we'll buy I'm here, I think. Yeah. Around 4,000. Hey. So, this Mark 5. Can we reduce the weight on it? I mean, we can. We want these. I'm not going to go with the rivets. I'm not going to go with these. So, it is really nice. I am going to go with it. I'm not going to go with the unditching beam. I'm not going to go with that. 13,629. Let's go see how heavy the other one is. Uh... Twenty-nine. So we save around forty-five kilos, which isn't a whole lot, is it? I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay. Sign announced there. Any contracts? Nope. Alright, the side valve engine is done. We're gonna try doing these light engine components. It'll take nine days. We're gonna do it. need to hire uh, for the production hall I need to hire you assembly expert employer yes uh, does that reduce yeah it did reduce number of days nice all right we got some materials and heavy infantry support contract available okay let's see so we have 21 days Forty to seventy. So, is there was there a uh, delivery date on that? No, there's no agreed delivery date. But so offer deadline is in twenty one days. That's on May thirteenth. So we're in May thirteenth. 
So that would be the 5th of May or something. Or 5th of June. Sorry. Materials delivered. We're going to need to order a lot more stuff. We need to order some iron. Order something like that. A medium carbon steel we need more of. Yeah. Find that. High carbon steel we could do with some more of as well. Okay. So we're done in 14 days with this production. We have five in stock now. We've built 14, I think, right? Uh. All right. Well, in the next one, we will see if we can't win that contract and uh, deliver some tanks and not go bankrupt and lose like last time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you. Bye.